Hello and welcome to another round of Thea. Yesterday we made our way over here to the land of lava and stone to find the next clue on the journey to unlock our divine power. Um, and on the way we were up here in the land of the elves and we followed some clues regarding an old treasure map. We're now at two parts of that treasure map, or four, and um, yeah, we have not really an idea where to find the next clues, but we will, I guess, continue with our adventures and then we will probably figure out something. But first, we want to find the next step on the divine power uh, quest line. Was it divine power? It was something. It was divine path. Here. There's something. We could have a quick look over there. Why not? Once we're on the water. And we're definitely not in a hurry. We survived for 300 turns now. So one turn more or less probably doesn't hurt. I really like this dark shift ability that we got last time. We haven't used it yet, but it sounds really interesting. And I definitely want to try it. Uh, ancient structure, let's search the northern areas. Okay, it's a vault. We open the vault, we get some medium, uh, well it's not really very bad gear but it's also not really good gear. I think we're past the point that we would use this kind of stuff so we just recycle it for rare, for the raw resources. There's another one. We also have another um, research point, so we could check if we can build another building, maybe. I don't know if we have... we definitely have those things. Uh, alternatively, more gathering. Um, proves health and movement, intelligence and wit on children. This might be the thing we want. Let's see if we can build any of those. Some snakes. But our village is very well defended now with all the people here. Mm. Cushion, cushion beds. We can use the ancient wood and the mythical leather. Let's use that and the other one. Do we have enough resources for that? Uh, it doesn't look like it because you only use the, the materials once you build it. So we will run out of this ancient wood. Let's search here. You find a room that is not submerged, but it's guarded by a magical barrier. Um, let's try to break that. Yes, you break the spell and are free to loot this chamber, which you believe was once the study of a magic wielder. What do we get? A shadow wand. Hmm. I'm not super impressed, but very nice uh, materials. Armored stone on shadow bone. A dragon wand. 
same we recycle that one this one can go and the diamond scroll it's a very nice one i mean lullaby plus eight seconds i guess and 2.1 with intelligence maybe we should keep the scroll for now Let's check this one. Uh, let's search. You enter a party, a submerged chamber that is mostly intact, but you quickly realize this place is haunted. Okay, let's use our magic users again because they are very strong. Uh, we don't need that, and we don't need that, but we got forgotten essence. Um, last time we found some really nice stuff in those chambers. But not this time. Well, pure stone and malachite is kind of nice, but it could be more. So now we go down here. On sub, there seemed to be something up here, or it was just the the land itself that is burning. Might be worth checking out. The snakes attack us at home, but we have people here I wonder if we could do um, a summon with her and then play another one and then switch place with this one to make it quicker Let's see if that's possible. Yeah, now the other character has an attack speed of 0.0, .0 way quicker, and they even got some shielding based on that. That is very strong. Gives us the opportunity to use completely new strategies. snakes and we don't really have good backline characters here So don't really have any threat from those things. It is mainly to see this ability in action. Probably it would probably be more effective to switch the um, the order of the two ca characters right in the end to surprise everyone.
He seems to be a quite nice support character. He can break shields, he can switch the um, the order of others. We could now actually switch those two. How much shield do they even get? 20? No, 19 and 28. Okay. So two shield. It's not too much, but it's something. And now he attacks first and should kill those two. to know that we have some nice backup characters in the making in our village because the characters that we have with us right now they will turn old at some point mm. take some luck hmm well, let's take this one. Strength, of course. And more mysticism. He's... He has more mysticism than our second witch, I think. Okay, but it was just, um, oh no, it's probably a resource, yeah, it's blood bones. I turned off the resources for now to make it a little bit more uh, neat looking and a little bit easier to see what's going on. There were just too many things on the map at, at the same time. Check this one out, and this is definitely the last one. Uh, let's dive. Um, you search in other areas and discover that this must have been a treasury long ago. If any court remains, they're deep underwater, so you must dive and search for them. Which we did. Ooh, plus eight crafting. That is a very hefty amount of flat crafting. This one's rubbish and more rubbish. Can we go on land still? Yes, we can. Let's go here. And now we're way too heavy. Okay, that means we probably have to go back home. We have to go back home and drop off some ballast. And then we go back over here. Uh, Guardian of Might. Well. Oh. Right on the, the pirate village. Let's fight. Not a problem at all. And we get a boat swain. Um, research material don't need that the rest is good yeah. that's it Ooh, nine I think those are the strongest pirates that I've saw seen so far um, our second witch is getting old let's teach what she has learned uh, summon unleaving rat 
I don't like this ability, but apparently now both our child children can do it. And the reason why I don't like it is because you pay with your own life for it. Well, could have been better, could have been worse. It's free stuff, so who well, I should complain? Um, What is that? A brood. 54 strength. I think that's fine. No one is really hurt. I don't think we need any of those. Or this. Or this. should probably check how um, we are with the production of food at home because I have a feeling that we might run out of food at some point. Um, perception. Well, I guess it's intelligence for you. Oh. Night power on the witch. I'm not sure if we need showing off on you, but it's better than battle orders, so let's take it. in northern areas. You find a vault locked by an old mechanism that defies decay and likely brawn too. Let's try to open it. Yes. Um. Ooh. You work out the mechanism and get into the wall. Although the structure is very durable, much of the contents have been either taken or destroyed. Still you find some things that may be of use. This is a, a very strong armor. 90 increased shielding. That is definitely something that we can use on our um, chosen orc. Because this is probably, yeah, 145 is very heavy. But I think he, yeah, he's very strong. I think that makes sense because he can't wear, uh, he can't use a shield and we can um, give this armor to him. Well he's just, this is just crazy having so high armor stats and all of this. Mm. We should try to find a weapon that gives shield leech and then he's very kitted out. But maybe we should switch those around. Because that would give him a little bit more boost in shield. Mm. Yeah, I think I'm kind of happy with that. That's another village. Well, next round. But first, we want to check how we're doing with the food. Some of us can definitely, well, we're running out of food. I can see it. Mm. 
Okay, you are definitely good at collecting, but not good at crafting. You are our crafter. But I think we have someone cooking. Yeah. Now we should collect fish, and with the fish we can then cook. can also start building another something new soon if we have the resources for it which I kind of doubt right now more mysticism the village garden trade please wisdom definitely strength whenever we have the choice and then we attack. Um. Hundred and four damage now. is just crazy we can increase his armor by 43% now but I was looking for isn't there someone um, let's play her to reduce the damage um, but I thought we had someone that could break shields wasn't that the case he's shielding more no apparently not mm, well do we do I think we could put up some archers to take some hits I think I'm happy with that those really heavy hits he certainly doesn't do too much damage but he is a very good tank sound damage I mean 49 that's that's a lot Let me find some wood we win uh, we needed some high grade wood for uh, one of the buildings that we wanted to burn so this one's an easy fight so we don't need to roll it ourselves 
deconstruct all those armors because they're really heavy and we don't need them. Oh, this is a small village. Um, the ruins have been underwater for too long to hold anything of great value, but you spot some potential materials you could salvage. There is, however, a lot of sea life there that you'd need to clear if you want to proceed. Of course we want to proceed. Um, not a problem at all. A wooden codex, which is crap, but we need... Oh! The water demons liked that? I thought we would fight water demons the whole time here, but apparently not. Sometimes I'm not really sure about who's part of which faction now. Uh, sailing during a storm, you notice a woman who's desperately holding on to a piece of wood. Let's help the drowning woman. And it is a human child. I think that's the second human child that we fish out of the water. Um, definitely very valuable. What is this? Inspire. Okay, so they will fight. Um, it is, um, it scales with intelligence. Well, you have a decent amount of intelligence. And it decreases the delay by two and increases the character's combat attributes. Might be nice. Definitely better than dark knowledge. Um, Mysticism, strength, more life or basilisk? Hmm. I think the poison bite is very very strong and having the ability to have a poison damage uh, attack whenever we need it is I think nice um, those are not very good Let's fight those pir pirates. Oh, that one's a nice one. Uh, we will definitely hold on to that one. Our ghost at home. It's crazy how much mysticism this one gets. Um, but I'm not really happy about uh, the actual abilities that it had. And it's not able to use full slots, so it's not a really strong character. It's more like a beast jury character. this one's nice because you can use it even without in the fights where you can't use weapons you can even use this one and it's for all different types of challenges so it's just a very well-rounded ability to have this on the other hand is not good and line charge is what do we want with this one? Maybe wisdom? Or we could build her into another fighter. It will take 52 rounds. But we could have another fighter. At some point our fighters will grow old so it might be good to 
develop a new fighter in time. I also think that we have them roughly around the same time. So they might turn old at the same time and we then lose our both our front uh, our frontline fighters at the same time, which would be very bad. Let's swim to the western parts. Um, it's the same with the valuable resources. And Stonewood Relic. It's nice. So, oh, it has some Shield Leech. I think Shield Leech is the strongest ability in the game for late game. Because you basically don't care if they... Um, punch down your shield as long as they don't damage your life force they don't do permanent damage to you okay but we don't need those we're getting heavier and heavier but soon we're home Summon the rats. Wisdom. Oh, another new one. Ghost touch on the witch. Mm, this is very interesting. Why would I take that? I think it's... Well, you can use it everywhere. But overall, it's not too strong. I think night power is better for us. Strength, of course. More strength. So many pirates. supposed to be boosted in intelligence and it looks like we're running out of fuel at home so we probably need to put someone on collecting wood well we have a lot of fish now maybe collect some grains instead and we can um, cook some other stuff as soon as we run out of meat which I believe we already did now we're home we have so much stuff with us fish for the fish salad um, you two were cooking um, well let's check our equipment because we brought home some really nice stuff um, you are supposed to be an intelligence character so this is not for you this is not for you either no it is the codex that is for you. Well, you don't need that. Do we have some ropes? We can have the ropes. Who's next?
I think we have something better than that for you. This one looks very nice. do we have on the next side yeah Raslava should be okay we didn't bring back any um, any weapon but you can at least have a shield for now probably look for a nice bow too or something that sta uh, scales with perception for her well that's it for now let's put the guys that we usually take with us again those six and we take the wayfarer some meatballs and some wood and then we're off again following our initial um, plan okay we can't anymore but next round um, one quick thing we have a lot of research points what do we want to build next? Okay. Build this. I'm not sure if we have it. I wouldn't be surprised if we don't have the required. Um, yeah, we can't. We don't have enough materials for it. But we can build the instruments, I believe, with ancient wood and forgotten essence. Goblin, Demon or Orc attraction. Let's take Goblin. Just because it's so high. Or do we go with Default again? No, we just play in the lottery. Mm. I think we're good with the fish for now. Four turns for that. And yeah, that was some village management, but it was needed. Back to the sea again. Okay, but that's not on our real direct path over to the other island. 
so we will ignore that for now. Um, sneak attack, it's kind of a weird skill, but so is this. We can take this one and see what happens. We definitely clean this part of the sea now. There's no pirate inside. Okay, there are some wolves coming. That's good. We need some new. We need some more um, meat. It's sad that we don't have any high value resources around our village. Well, maybe I should research them because then we can something to pay for um, if there are traders coming by. Let's see. It is dark wood that we have up here. We have monster bones and we have mithril. I think this mithril is in range, isn't it? Yes. So let's collect mithril. And it takes two turns for 20, which is really nice because it is very high value. We can use it to smith stuff and also we can use it to trade with if we get another goblin trader that is of course okay this is a small island where we don't want to land because then we have to go back onto the sea again wasting another turn I think overall this whole thing took quite a long time already. You hear the scream of a child in the village. Everyone gathers at his house and they see the child's mother standing by him. Only his mother has been dead for weeks. As she turns her head, you see her face is pale and gaunt. Her eyes empty and yet fixated on the child. When she opens her mouth as she speaks, only a loud speech shriek comes out, revealing two sets of sharp teeth in her now unnaturally wide mouth. Um, well, I've learned something in this game we should observe. You observe the village and the creature and spot there was no sev now several of them in your village. They seem to be looking for their loved ones and once found they fix it on them. One villager has already been sucked dry. Uh, okay. Our. Well, you shouldn't get too attached with people here. Let's use a trap. Okay. Um, plus 11 luck. That is incredibly high luck. Well, let's attack. That's not a threat to us. But still, we lose... We lose our wall. Hmm. Before really trying him out. 
well that's how it is in this game I don't think we need this or this what is energy blur I've never seen that okay it's just a attack an alternate attack alternative attack um, well not worth it and we get attacked by some pirates that's a nice amount of high uh, value materials at least You quicker mysticism, you either luck or luck. Let's take the luck. Mm. You are the hunter, not the fighter and we're back on this island let's see we might manage to get a bit further this time This is our fighter, our future fighter, so it's strength. Okay, there's a water layer, but we don't want to go back onto the water. Okay, we are out of mushrooms. Can we do anything else? I don't think we can do fish with fish to make some baked fish. Hmm. There are some some pirates at home too. One of your people has been acting oddly over the last few days. They seem weak, they sweat more, and sometimes you catch them speaking to themselves. Um, well, either give them a good beating or we try to cure them. Well, we definitely try to cure them, of course. Which is good enough. Um, you try your best to cure your friend and think you did it. They start acting normal again and even feel stronger than before. Uh, max life and strength on our um, ghost. Nothing that we need on her, but it's a positive effect and we definitely take that. There's so much stuff that can go wrong, so every positive is a good thing. You are ambushed by org bandits. Um, uh, in Zoya's name, demand respect. You see the orcs hesitate when you invoke Zoya's name, but you also know that your goddess is one of combat and valor, so they are unlikely to stop and talk on her account. Let's attack them. Okay, we have an orc gatherer. Well, some wolves and an orc plobber, which we have too, so we should be able to do that easily. Especially since our orc plobber is probably way stronger than theirs. What is that? That's not an orc, that's a weakling. This is an orc.
Okay, this is just miserable to see. think that there's any way that this goes wrong. some bones some stones and some meat they shouldn't have uh, attacked us but they liked that apparently well typical orc things i guess oh here no that's the arena we don't want to go to the arena i did that once that was that was the hardest thing i've ever seen in this game As you travel the lands, you are drawn to a particular place, guided by a star. When you come closer, you see three human women standing together silently. One is young, tall and muscular, her eyes wild with fire, her features almost orcish. One is much older, gray-haired but no less athletic, with garb more like that of a sage, and her eyes glazed with the purple light of magic. The final one is middle-aged, and she looks weakened, barely standing, her body tearing itself in two. Several orc blood trackers stand in your way. Halt if you wish to live! A matriarch steps out of the shadows. You are Zora's pup, I smell it! You must not interfere! We long yearned for her to become truly of turmoil and look! The weakling sides are losing. Soon Zorza will be the warrior she is meant to be. You see fire in the matriarch's eyes. And you notice that all your people but you, the Chosen, have been taken aside by the orcs. No one but the matriarch stands in your way. Let's see what becomes out of uh, Zoya. You hear the scream of all three women. The middle one is torn in two. The older one withers away, and the young one turns to flame and perishes. Deathly silence falls upon you, and as you glance at the matriarch, she lies dead, her body burned from the inside. You still feel your connection to Zoya. She is not gone. But you also know that you have failed your final task and will not receive any last blessings. Hmm. What the hell? So close. And I thought they that it would be the right choice to let them finish this ritual. But we could have we should have known. Of course, our god of hatred and war wants us to just knock them over the head. Well, good, good, good. That's this. That's very disappointing. I feel like we could fight in the arena now. It's time for some fighting. Let's fight.
let's increase our armor. the most important is not getting chip damage over time and with that I mean they shouldn't penetrate our shields This guy had so much shields, but it doesn't help him at all. Now he's killing himself on the retaliation, which is nice. this one. we kill those easily with one hit I think he almost kills everything now with one hit okay that was the first round um, let's fight it is one demon 40 strength That's quite nice, having just one guy to attack, because that means we will always affect the same one with the witch's suck. twice, the witch twice, and then increasing his shield again. We will get some damage.
Okay, we actually got a lot of damage on our witch, which is not good at all. better than that I believe so the problem that we now have is that this freaking dragon does incredible damage we can't really risk her anymore. Tricky. No, we can't use the witch. She would just die. We need more damage, though. How much damage does he do? 22. I think if we put him here, he finishes them quicker. Let's see. It was very bad that we lost so much life on all the witch. Now we can attack the dragon straight ahead. That's good. 
We didn't take any additional damage on our characters. We just reduced our shields. Ooh, that's crazy. Why would you not play that on the dragon? Good that they didn't. We can speed it up. Um, yeah. He should heal first. Hopefully her. just to make sure that they don't take any damage here. Let's see. The plan is to heal our witch a bit, so that we might be able to use her again. second time well that is a lot of loot but we're not over it uh, not through it yet we don't need that we don't need that we keep that for now because I don't know we might be able to use it um, those might be something. Those are definitely something. This one's fine. This one is very nice. This one is very nice too. Uh, we finally found a weapon for our hunter. This one is very nice. This one's quite nice. And those ones are trash. But let's fight them. I think we can do better than that. And we start. Okay, what the hell they are. They have so much life and they do so much damage. Even 50% increased against armor. Ooh. 
this is not good. Hundred. Hundred and nine. What's wrong with those? What should I ever do against those? him again and speed him up which would be 200 something damage and only one of them attacks but still that's not enough and that's not counting for other people that they could still play but I think I need the damage Right now we have 160, 70, 180, uh, 280 damage maybe. That's not even enough to kill them. Seven now. He is killing us. That was only the first one. He has more. Okay, those are weaker, but still. Uh, I hope this was the last one. If not, that. Uh, is a problem. Shield the witch twice. And then we put this one in front. Let's 
there's a very nice fireball here. Oh. oh, so close. But he just attacks the shield. That's good. and sea skeletons alike here be our new champions now we did well matthias but if we really want to be called victories you go visit the doom of thunder there you'll be faced with some real foes well i thought this was already hard enough for now now let us drink and party champions uh celebrate and then leave well let's pay and let your wounds be healed five thousand I think we can cancel that. Because we can perform a ritual instead, which should heal us too. And a faith one, two. should help us all. We should also check if anyone can use some of the news uh, some of the new stuff that we found. 2020 uh, well this one's not better than that. Ropes. They're slightly worse in physical challenges, but he gets shielding in all challenges. You can have those. Let's have a look. She might be interested in one of those. Okay, but this one is just better. Max health, shielding, shielding. Uh, it's definitely better than this one. So because he has the shield, uh, the the weapon that gives him life steal, and this way he has a lot of life. Sadly, we still don't have any good weapons uh, for for the orc. He's still he's still running around with a mithril battle axe. Is AOE is just super strong. I just don't want to. I simply don't want to lose that ability. Mm. He also has a not so great weapon, I have to say. But yeah, 
we won the arena, even though it was close. And now it's winter. basically done here. Oh, well hello there. I didn't see you before. Uh, one night you wake up and you see a character in a long coat with a hood. He's standing over one of your companions. He has a huge scythe in his hand. Who you are? What are you doing here? The Grim Reaper looks at you and responds with an ice voice. I have come for the soul of this mortal. Do not disturb me. Um, put the life of your companion in the game against the Reaper. Yes, absolutely. Because we are quite smart. Um, we get some luck on our Chosen. Who is still quite badly hit, hurt. So we should probably perform another ritual to heal him even more. And one for faith, because I saw he was still low in faith too. attacked by light demons which is not a problem a monster bow well we don't want that so much damage on her uh, one morning you noticed that there were that a new different chicken has appeared among your hands it is slightly larger and its feather have a nice yellow glossy color let's take the best care of it and it gives us diamonds and malachite and some steel the diamonds we can really need. That's a big demon. strong character for the mental challenges because he's not doing too hot so far uh, let's attack those we don't want to them on the map at all. This one's trash. Uh, this one's also kind of trash. Well, more of most of it is kind of trash, but at least we get a lot of different materials like this crystal wood and the sacred wood and this ancient wood is quite nice. This one's another trash item. And we remove the village. Uh, more 
wisdom or strength. Oh, now we get dark heart. I feel like it's a bit late for that, but we definitely take additional shielding. Um, we take more shielding here too, and of course more strength. How are we doing here? Why can't we do this yet? Okay, we need more. We just need a little bit more secret alloy and we would have enough. too far away. A new character has been attracted to your village. Yeah, we lost some characters, so let's see what we got. Uh, human bandit leader. Improvised cover. Okay, uh, so they get increased shielding. And they have brute force, and that's it. Um, quite nice wisdom and strength overall, but yeah. Yes, of course we take the bandit leader. I don't know what kind of abilities they can get. So, so far it's not too impressive, but it might get interesting. Uh, oh, what's that? Some sharks. Um, okay. Um, those are some trash items. This one might be interesting. But we just take the better one of the two. I don't think we will need multiple of it. We don't need that or that. Um, well, it gave us a lot of experience. This one's new. Protective word. Word. Uh, okay. Makes it able to support in mental and magical challenges. So why not? Let's investigate. You swim to the south and discover many large chambers, partly submerged, that still hold on to an echo of greatness. You dive to search through one such magnificent room and you spot a dead kraken. Well, I like them when they're dead. I'm a bit intimidated when they are still alive. But I think after the... After the... Um, after we fight, fought in the arena, we probably can take on a Kraken as well. Uh, some more trash. A thick 
sickly fog descends upon your village and within a few nights folk begin to fall ill with a heavy fever. Okay, this might be f from an occult source. Or we could ask our god about it. Uh, let's ask our god about it. The few folk speak strange names, 12 of them, over and over again. This and the mist make you sure uh, Febra has come from beneath the earth. The Febra are 12 sisters of sickness. You need to know the names of the one who is here to banish it. Healer or intelligence, try to cure the people. Uh, let's try that. We can get some max life on two of our characters. Let's stay strong and wait for the favor to pass on. That one I haven't seen before either. strength character I would guess based on on the abilities that she has so far counter attack which is of course it's a retaliation that works with uh, her perception which she has not much. So let's take improvis improvised cover. She has a bunch of life. It's probably because of all the life's buff in, uh, in our village. take the luck I don't want either of it but yeah. the winds on this day are promisingly good all crew members are in a good mood that's good we're so slow because we are so heavy but we have a lot of good stuff with us stupidly strong sadly the witch is squishy but besides that I really like what she has as abilities more strength can see if we have something for our bandit leader probably have something um, this is a suitable armor
We don't really have a good weapon for her though. We should probably invest in some weapon smithing. Um, I like sword and shields. I think that's kind of boring though. But it's also very effective in my opinion. So let's take all those sword smithing things. And now we can see what we can do. We have a shit ton of mithril. Armor pen and poison. Um, what else can we do? Armor pen life leech. Armor pen area of effect. Armor pen poison. Um, Armor pen additive. Area of effect life leech. Uh, how do we get? Poison damage shield leech. And that's the one that I want. Mm, can we get poison? Uh, Shield pen and shield leech is what I wonder. Life leech, shield leech also sounds really nice. Effect shield leech. Uh, maybe that's the thing that we want. And we have a lot of those ingredients. Shield leech. Oh, and it even is possible to use it in other challenges then. Um. So this would also be mental challenge. And higher than higher damage multiplicator, but it would be intelligence on uh, in mental challenges, so it would probably be not very strong in most challenges. This seems very strong to me. Life leech, shield leech. How would you ever um, kill someone like that? Um. 
armor pen shield leech that's what we're looking for so it's the last one um, Okay, but it has to be stone essence. Stone essence, metal essence. I see. So it's only armored stone that gives us that. I think this is the this or just the pure one. I think we will do this one. <laughs> one more. Pretty sure we can do something for that. Um, see yep now it's enough so we can build one of those every round uh, let's make it three and then we put those on our people for some curses I'm not sure if we have any but I think we might yeah we had mental curses the whole time I totally forgot that This one um, check we have three of those very great weapons so 47 the last one there she is you can take one too and a shield uh, not a bad character overall um, we can give this sword to him We can have that sword for now. Mm. How's our research doing? 
where it's just her. two-handed swords soon too but I think that's a topic for next time uh, it's getting late uh, thank you all for watching and I'll see you next time good night <laughs>